Hey guys, so CinemaCon is going on right now and Universal had their presentation in regards to Twisters. So Twister is one of my all-time favourite movies. I've rewatched it so many times and I really do feel like the special effects hold up even to this day. And I've got to say the special effects from what I saw with the Twister trailer, they're not quite as impressive to me as the original movie and I know it's been so long since that movie was made so the effects should be better but I guess they relied a lot on practical effects back then well obviously it was a movie about tornadoes so there's only so much they can do without CGI but still they incorporated special effects in it somehow in a really clever way that just made it so realistic and I didn't get that same vibe of Twisters. But having said that, I'm still definitely looking forward to this movie. And in terms of CGI, it still looks good, don't get me wrong. And Glenn Powell, I think his character looks like a lot of fun. So from what I've seen, it's not going to be like a the legacy cast aren't coming back. The originals aren't going to be in this. But, you know, I'm okay with that let this be its own thing. So the CinemaCon attendees were lucky enough, jealous, to see some footage of this. And I don't think we're going to get another trailer. Like maybe we will, but probably not. So yeah, it looks like this is the best way I can go about finding out what they saw. So the extended preview starts off at a rodeo, which is disrupted by a giant tornado as bulls and horses run wild amidst the chaos. We see scenes of Powell's character assemble a group of storm chasers as two tornadoes combine to form a super tornado. They're definitely just going to the next level. It's all right to be scared. Fear is the reason you do it, Powell's character said. He's definitely like really chasing that high that comes with storm chasing I guess you don't face your fears you ride them oh gosh wow so the new footage looks huge with tons of stuff happening but he added that it looks a little bombastic I'm guessing that's a bad thing when compared to the more realistic tone of the original movie still it has a very fun upbeat vibe with Powell and Edgar Jones having some great chemistry. So, yeah, it just talks about the director. And Edgar Jones plays Kate Cooper, a former storm chaser haunted by a devastating encounter with a tornado during her college years, who now studies storm patterns on screen safely in New York City who's then lured back into storm breaking with the reckless social, uh, social media superstar played by Powell, who thrives on posting his storm chasing adventures. So it sounds like he's going to have his own crew. And then this girl, Kate Cooper, is someone who likes the safety of being behind the screen out of the danger zone and she's going to get sucked into the danger zone. See what I did there? Sucked in. Yeah, making some tornado-related humour. So, as storm season intensifies, terrifying phenomena never seen before are unleashed as their competing teams find themselves squarely in the paths of multiple storm systems converging over central Oklahoma in the fight of their lives. So it's going to be like, obviously, tornado alley. So... Yeah, I thought that Kin and Shipka might play, what's her name? The lead actress in the first movie. I know her name, but I thought it would be Jo. It's Jo, right? It would be her daughter. I don't know. Maybe they'll go in that direction. I haven't really seen any talks about her character, but either way, I'm excited for this. I think that it looks like it's going to be its own thing it's not trying to be the original which I appreciate because that movie was lightning in a bottle it was so good I don't feel like it could ever touch that level of awesome you know you need to just go in your own direction with this 
and that seems to be what they're doing so yeah I'm happy with this let me know what you guys think down below feel free to like comment subscribe and I'll see you in the next video